Guitarist, what's up? So today we are going to review the KSR series preamp distortion pedal and definitely hang for this video because there's some important like information that you need to know about this, but I'll show you at the end. Um, but anyways, let's get to the playing. Going through a Mesa Duel, I have a Vintage 30 mic'd up with one SM57 and a uh, K or G1275T with an SM57. And then I have my Gibson SG with a bare knuckle war pig in it. And yeah, I'm playing in drop B. Let's go. to show you guys also what does this sound like as as it goes through the back of a tube head and what does the amp itself sound like so we're going to compare this to a Mesa Duel and then we're going to play the KSR so when I have the hand on the KSR that's what I'm playing and then the without this it's going to be the Mesa so this is what it sounds like <laughs> So I actually have not compared these on the computer yet, so definitely tell me your thoughts and if you think the Mesa sounds better than the KSR or does the KSR going into the Mesa sound better. I definitely think this is a very clear distortion and getting to the point of do I think it's worth your money, it really depends. Um, for me personally, I wanted another guitar or an, I wanted another amp, but I didn't want to buy another whole amp. So like I was actually looking at the diesel pedals preamp distortions and then I came across this on YouTube and I kind of just had to buy it because I was like, well, it has three channels in it. And like the problem with the diesel ones, it's only one channel. And when you turn it off, the bypass shuts off the amp. Like it, do it does not play your clean signal. And I didn't like that. Um, so this is kind of like a three in one deal. Not that I would use like the clean to record or anything, but like to play live, um, it's kind of it's kind of nifty. And like if you're on a budget but want a good amp and you don't want to carry a lot of stuff, this plus like the power stage uh, Seymour Duncan Solid State Power Stage, a lot of people have been like comparing to like going with this because they say it sounds really good. Um, I didn't buy it because I'm just gonna take a two head and play a show with that. You know what I mean? And um, I already have tube power so why would i buy a solid state you know I, I think tube power just sounds better um but yeah if you were wanting a different tone and didn't want a new big amp and didn't want to pay for a full amp this is kind of the next option and this is the only pedal that offers that you know the three channels so i do think it is it is worth it um but it really depends on what you need it for because four hundred dollars like I'm gonna have to admit, like that's a lot of money for a pedal. That's the most I've ever paid for a pedal. And um, I've never tried KSR uh, products or like, was it Rhodes amps? Um, just uh, never really found one. They're, they're kind of rare, but I do think they're good. The only negative thing I have about this pedal, and maybe that's just me, but like, it's very tight, don't get me wrong. It's like the modern tight metal distortion. And it actually has a tight knob inside that you can click or whatever, and it makes it even tighter. To me, that's ridiculous because like, I just, I, I don't like that. I have to have at least a little bit of bass. Uh, but if you're in a really low tuning, this pedal's probably really awesome for that. I'm talking like really low tunings. Um, but my problem was these like knobs, I don't know if you saw whenever I did the switching, doesn't really make all that big of a difference. And the bass is probably my real only complaint. It doesn't, it's not there at all. Like I crank the bass all the way up and basically it just gets like a little bit muddier, but it doesn't really give you that like voomp. Um, maybe it's because I was just playing the Mesa or in the Mesa's very bassy, but like I think that's why this pedal's so clear is because there's like, 
almost absolutely no bass in this pedal. So that's my only complaint. Um, the three channel modes is pretty cool. I really honestly just keep them on the high gain one. And on the back, it has the instructions as far as the bright on and off, the feel, fat, tight, thick, and then you have the modes. Uh, Aries Crunch, Aries Red, and Carnellis Lead or whatever. I can't even read that. But um, And it has like their address, their phone number on it. Um, this is a really like great idea. Like I don't know why pedals have not done this. Um, but yeah, I do like it. But I do I do question like did I need to spend four hundred dollars on a distortion pedal? I really didn't. Um, but I definitely wanted to review it for you guys. I wanted to see how it holds up to the, like the real amps. Will I use it in studio? Possibly. It is really clear, and you know I might use it to like stack on other amps. But like I said, like maybe like I I don't think I like too much bass on my guitars. But like I don't know. Like I usually have like the PV and the Mesa. The Mesa, this is where my, my bass is on my Mesa, just so you can get an idea. My bass is almost off on my Mesa, and like it still like has this like just thick thump to it. And this pedal, you turn the bass all the way up, and there's no thick thump to me. Um, maybe that's just like a KSR thing, but that's my only real complaint. Um, but let me know in the comments like what you think, and if you think it's worth the money. Um, I'm glad I bought it. I think it was it was like a cool thing to review, and now you guys can see if it's worth your money. Um, but definitely don't just buy it because you think it's going to be like, you know, like the answer to all your problems kind of thing. Um, I think it's great, but like I said, it is four hundred dollars. So let me know in the comments what you think, and if you want to support my channel, I have merch now. Uh, a merch store. You can click in the description or you can just find the bar of what's for sale there. And um, check out my album, follow me on Instagram, and ring that little bell so then you can see the next videos. Peace. <laughs>